I'm sure you know this, but there are hundreds, if not thousands of claims circulating the internet, social media right now about the coronavirus. And our Verify team is working overtime to separate fact from fiction, and it is a full-time job. That includes one claim that warmer weather will kill the virus. Here's David Schechter. Scientific research on the coronavirus is moving fast, so I want to update you on some early data analysis that gets at a question a lot of you have been asking me. Will warm weather kill the virus? So this new report from the Massachusetts Institute of Technology is co-written by Dr. Kasim Bukhari. He looked at the growth curve of the virus in countries around the world and compared that to how hot and humid those countries are. So are you sort of finding a sweet spot between humidity and, and cases? That's what it seems like. So this is what it seems like uh, looking at the data. Dr. Bukhari's study called Will Coronavirus Pandemic Diminish in Summer? looked at 320,000 cases of COVID-19 worldwide. He found 90% of transmissions through March 22nd have occurred in regions that are cooler and drier. For example, the growth rate accelerated faster in Iran, Norway, France, and the United States, but it was much slower in warmer and more humid countries like Singapore, Thailand, and Indonesia. So what it means is, that, for example, in, in, in colder countries, cold and dry countries, uh, you may need to take more efforts. Like travel restrictions, social distancing, and the extent of underlying medical conditions in the community. In other words, there's still a lot to learn. Uh, we don't know whether temperature is more important. We don't know whether humidity is more important. Or we don't know whether both of them are actually equally important. So the early indications are that cooler, drier climates are at a disadvantage when it comes to fighting the virus. But when it comes to the question, will warm weather kill the virus? The answer to that is still unknown. If you've got questions, please send me an email or send me a tweet.